going on, everybody out there? This is Popular Stranger. We are back at you again today for another Mutt 16 online head-to-head -head gameplay. And in today's video, we're going to be featuring the brand new Final Edition 96 overall, Demarius Thomas. I picked this card up today. I ended up completing the set. We did it for about 340k. I probably could have waited. I would have got it cheaper if I did, but I wanted to bring you guys this video, show you what this car can do on the field, and we uh, updated our offense here. We're going to replace Larry Fitzgerald, the Team of the Week version, with this Demarius Thomas, and there is my updated lineup. Lots of changes on defense as well, so here we are jumping into the game. My biggest concern about making this switch is Ken Demarius Thomas have the spectacular catch abilities that Larry Fitzgerald have given me, you know, with his BCA card, then the Team of the Week card. He always goes up and just makes these crazy grabs in traffic with that aggressive catch animation. And though Demarius has the good run blocking, my biggest concern, again, is can he make those big-time catches? We'll have to wait and see. So Heinz Ward made one there. He came in on a substitution. I guess somebody was tired. And uh, he made a big catch, so we are quickly up 7 to nothing. Now, my opponent had a pretty good team. He's running the ball, and now he's going to go to the pass game on the third play of the game. Third and five, overthrows his receiver. He's getting a little risky here. Fourth and five, he goes for it, attacking that man-to-man -man defense. I can't blame him. He goes right back to the same play on the slant route to Michael Irvin. This guy had a lot of good wide receivers, so our secondary Really, really had to step it up in this game. McNabb's going to scramble, get inside to the two-yard line. He goes fullback dive and evens this thing up at seven apiece. So we threw Demarius the ball, you know, like once or twice. But let's take a shot downfield, see what he can do. This is against Charles Woodson, and we get it knocked out of our hands. So let's go to the run game here. Demarius Thomas brings that great run block ability. My team is loaded with good wide receivers who can run block now. We got Demarius Thomas, we got Brandon Marshall, and we got Heinz Ward. Basically, one of the, they're probably the top three run blockers in the game right now at wideout. CJ Spiller making a big catch, threw it into traffic there. I was a little nervous. We're going to go to the curl route here. That play, and I think you may have seen me run it once already, is a great man beater. It cannot be pressed. And it worked for me there. And now we're in the end zone. There's Demarius Thomas. He's going to score for you guys. My opponent ran commit on me there. So that was a pretty easy touchdown. Now check out this interception by DRC right here. He bobbled it, stays in bounds, catches the football. And we get the turnover. We're approaching halftime. I figured I'd kind of go the opposite of what he was probably thinking and run the ball. Good yardage. We step out of bounds. And now we're going to go downfield once more. There's Demarius Thomas. He's inbounds, though, so we have to burn a timeout. 22 seconds until halftime, and that's what happens when you're trying to force a throw to get a gameplay for YouTube. I really probably wouldn't have thrown that football any other time, but I was trying to, you know, get Demarius Thomas the ball. That's why you guys are here. That's what you want to see, and it ended up costing me, but not a big deal. We're still up 14-7. Eric Berry with the big interception here to start the second half off, and we have the ball once again. Let's throw it down to Demarius once more. God damn, I hate that catch animation when it doesn't work for me. That time it worked for me, and boy, oh boy, that animation is very frustrating when you're on the defensive ball. So third and 10, we're going to go to DT once more. He keeps his foot in bounds and picks up the first down, but we get a fumble. Marshall Falk coughs it up. He doesn't really do that often for me, but uh, he did in that situation. This guy is hanging around. You see the lurkage right there. We get the user pick interception. We have the ball once again, but I can just not put this guy away. It's the fourth quarter. We're going to find DT once more up into the eight-yard line. McNabb dropping back. Nobody is open. We try to scramble. We end up getting sacked, and now it's third and goal. I'm going to go back to this curl route. This time, it's intercepted. Sloppy, sloppy play in the second half on offense here, but we're still hanging on to that seven-point lead, trying to play some defense here. He's going into double coverage downfield. We're able to knock it loose. Now third and 10, two minutes and 12 seconds to go. He picks up a first down, a buck 34 to go now. Shot downfield, one-on-one -on -one coverage. DRC swats it away. Good defense, my friend. Second and 10 now. He's going to go to the screen game. Luke Keekley all over that. Third and nine. He's running out of chances. We get the sack with Big Gilbert Brown. 
In on fourth and 17, he goes to the out route. He converts. No, he doesn't. We stop him short of the chains. And we're going to get the rage quit. He didn't want to play defense for those last 54 seconds. We get the win. Demarius Thomas had a lot of yards. We just couldn't get him into the end zone. He had over 100 yards receiving in this game. A very, very good card. You guys can look for a review coming very soon for this card. Thanks for watching, guys. I'm out. Peace.